today we're gonna to take care of the dry cow pen free stalls. We're gonna chase the cows into the holding pen and then we'll scrape this all out, clean the stalls out, and put a fresh load of sand in here. Some may ask, why are we bedding with sand? Well, there's two reasons why we bed with sand. Number one is sand does not harbor bacteria. It's a non-organic material. And so as long as there's not manure mixed in with the sand or the sand's not dirty, it's basically bacteria free. And so as the cows lay on it, you know, they're, they're, when they lay down, their udders touch the bedding that they're in. And if there's any bacteria up against their udders, there's always a chance of getting infected with mastitis and such and so you eliminate a lot of that by using the sand and then the second reason we use sand is it's fairly cost effective we're still about i think we're four to five dollars a ton and so we bring 15 ton at a time 15 to 18 ton on our our trucks and so it's really cost effective to do that and we use it takes about a load a week between the dairy cows and the dry cows here to keep everything bedded up good so the one downfall of us using sand is this is our manure pit here 60 by 60 five foot deep and as everything is pushed off right here this is our push off ramp so all of the dairy cows free stalls and the dry cow free stalls all gets pushed into here and those are all bedded with sand and so we'll get a a sandbar in our manure pit so you can see right now they're we're pumping the liquid off to pump off as much liquid as we can and then this is a ramp and down into the pit here we'll have to thin and clean out the solids and then right through here and in this area right here it'll all just be Pure sand. We'll have to go ahead and scoop in. And we'll, we'll haul it out, haul it out to the fields. And so that's the downfall of using sand. It does separate in your pit. You're going to have to scoop it out, either using the skid loader or having an excavator come in, scoop it out. So we can get in with the skid loaders. It's no problem for us to clean it out. This pit was designed with that in mind. We've had it for you know 10 or 12 years here at least. And before this, we didn't have any manure storage. All we had was a little bit of flat storage and our runoff ran off into a settling pond. And so when we were able to put this pit in, it made it a whole lot easier to manage our manure, to haul it at the right time, 